Director, another UPA head uh, rose this time under the new government. It's the Mizoram governor, Kamla Beniwal, who had long-standing differences with Narendra Modi when he was Chief Minister of Gujarat. The sacking comes two months before her tenure ends and exactly a month after she was shifted from Gujarat to Mizoram. Sources now say this is because of her alleged involvement in a land scam four years ago in her home state of Rajasthan, where she claimed uh, plots of land from the government in lieu of working 14 to 16 hours a day as hard farm labour, even while she was chief minister in the Ashok Gehlot government in the state. My colleague uh, Harsha Kumari Singh joins us now for more on this. Uh, Harsha, Kamla Beniwal's uh, uh, claims about working as farm labour came as a surprise even that time to the Gehlot government. So on the one hand, while there is this issue of that scam and the aftermath of it, uh, this is also perhaps being seen in the light of her differences with Narendra Modi. Well, absolutely. The technical reason, of course, is this land scam. The BJP had raked it up then itself and said it's impossible for somebody who was deputy chief minister in the Gehlot government to be herself performing 14 to 18 hours of hard labor on that land, which was given to them as a farming cooperative. But the, but the, uh, but the farmers' cooperative, of which she was a part, used that uh, as, an, uh, as a claim uh, to get uh, pot, plots of land from the Gehlot government at rates which were much less than the market rate. Of course, the registrar of cooperatives uh, objected to that, and that case is still with the tribunal. Uh, but according to sources, this is where they have uh, sort of used, um, this is where they have said that her conduct was unbecoming. We seem to have uh, lost that connection. In court. Uh, so let's see how that pans out. Uh, but definitely the land scam in Rajasthan uh, has been used against Kamala Benibar. Right, we seem to have... Uh, thanks, Harsha, for those uh, details. Of course, this is uh, a story of governor's appointments and transfers and sacking that we have been uh, following since the new government took over. Uh, but on, on this count, as you pointed out, several layers that could be adding to the controversies as well.